It is 10 a.m. We left home at 2 a.m. Then we flew to Nashville. Now we're gonna go to Gaylord Opryland Resort and check it out. This video is gonna show you how incredible of a property Gaylord Opryland in Nashville is. Uh, between the bridges, the wild plants, foliage, flowers, and waterfalls, fountains all around, uh, malls, river, river boats. Uh, this place is a must to do in Nashville. Even if you come here, not staying here, bring your family here and spend easily three, four, five, six hours shopping, eating, walking around or even finding a bench or a quiet corner so you can read a book. Uh, we're gonna start from Cascades, go into Garden Conservatory, walk through Delta, come back out, go into Magnolia. And then there's a whole convention center here. Let's go. So this is the main restaurant, ponds, fishies. And here's the bridge so the first impression of anyone coming to Gaylord it's it's just such a impressive hotel and concept more streams that's to the cascade lobby down below the spa and fitness center is this way dining restaurant area right next to the waterfall this is the one I stayed at maybe about eight years ago and um, I had a wonderful time. I had a balcony facing in. This one, it says Cascades. There's a number of neighborhoods. We're gonna go explore a couple of them in this video. There's a lot of conferences here. I can actually see all these people with a badge hanging. You wanna come here when there is no conference happening to get some of the best deals. Cascades, definitely a great neighborhood. So you come from the Cascades and uh, right away, there's more bridges, walkways down below, going into rooms. Somebody sitting there reading. What kind of a tree is this? This is a... Okay, I've never seen a tree like this. So if you're watching this video and you know what kind of a tree this is, please comment below. Okay, there is the conservatory skywalk that we're gonna go through. So this is called the garden walkway and it's really a maze of steps and layers with plants and all these little nooks and crannies that you can walk through. Look at that. I thought we were on the ground floor, but then there's another floor underneath us. And streams and walkways. Look at that incredible flower that turns into this. It's such a beautiful space. You almost want to have like a quiet weekday here where you can bring a book down, sit down on a bench, let the time go by.
This is beautiful. Now there's a giant library in the middle, right over there. We're gonna do a quick walkthrough. We just did the old Hickory walkway, the nice river of source. You can see the track. I think that's where the that's where the boat runs. A nice planter, that's what Chris likes. And then this is the island, like a lot of shopping area with houses and restaurants. So we're gonna go there next. Thank you, sir. His special delivery. All right, so we got hungry and stopped for some house-made chips. Oh, let me see that burger. Oh, that Oh, that looks pretty good. So now we're going to enjoy this. So now we're going to go out of the mall area. I would say this was the most fun. All right, so right next to the mall is Delta River Boats. This is where we're sitting. We just did a circle. By the way, we got another wave. Let's keep walking towards Convention Center. We'll get out there. Oh, I can barely walk after that burger. This may look like a two minute walk, but you can totally get lost in here. So Delta is incredible. That's where the river boat is as well. So we're heading towards Magnolia. So a lot of stores. There's a live radio station here. And there's restaurants and bars, stores. Look at this grand staircase entrance and that ceiling. You know, this hotel typically goes for 400 a night. I think it's totally worth staying here for that price. Between the atriums, all the restaurant shops, you can come and easily spend three, four days and not get bored. I'm gonna head back out. gonna go from here to a tiny cabin somewhere north of Tennessee and check that out came back to Gaylord Opryland Resort and again we are parking at the Inn at Opryland because it's free and all we're gonna do is walk across the street and it's another 10 minute walk into that resort all right so we parked our car at 8.07 and now it's 8.20. So this is a quick test. If you want to save the $33 and you do park across the street, it is 13 minute walk to enter through Cascades. Okay, welcome to Gaylord at night. This place is a must to do when in Nashville. Catch you guys next time. Oh, look at that plant. Grand leaf sea grape. 70 feet tall. The leaves are globular in size that can reach a diameter of 20 inches. Put, can you put your face right next to it? Okay, one second. One. Isa.
who seems to be singing and Kiz who seems to be breaking the rules and laws and the Gaylord police is coming. Let's get out. Okay, do it one more time. <laughs>